Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install MX Linux 23.6 on VirtualBox. First go to MX Linux official website that is mxlinux.org. Hit enter. Then click on download. See here we have the latest version MX 23.6. And we have different editions like XFCE, KDE, Fluxbox. Okay. And see here we have the options like direct repo, mirrors and torrent. Okay. So click on this MX Linux 23. In this video I am going to download and install XFCE edition. So click on this one. See it is going to download MX Linux from the source forge. At a moment download will be started. See download started go to download see here its size is 2.2 gigabytes I am cancelling this one because I have already downloaded see here I have already downloaded MX MX 23.6 ISO file once download is completed then open virtual box if you want to install virtual box on your machine then there is a link in the video description you can go through it and you can install virtual box click on you are machine and select new either is fine to create the virtual machine then provide the name for the virtual machine then select the folder to store this virtual machine files and folders click on drop down and this is the default location if you want some other location click on other then select the path where you have the enough space to store this virtual machine files and folders Then select the ISO image that is downloaded ISO image. Click on drop down, select other, then go to downloads directory. See here we have the MX Linux. Select open, then change the type to Linux, then select the subtype to Debian. Why? Because it is of the type Debian, Debian 64 bit. Then come to hardware, then by default memory selected, base memory selected as 2 gigabytes. I am giving it to 4. It is up to you based on availability. Then number of CPU equals to hard disk I am giving 50 gigabytes then click on finish still if you want to modify the settings of this virtual machine right click and select settings the R click on settings R machine and select settings all three options are same for okay with all the settings then click on start use up and down arrows let me maximize it use up and down arrows and the select first one that is MX 23.6 64 and hit enter let me try to maximize it whether we will get the full screen or not see we got the full screen okay see if you want to use this for temporary purpose or te testing purpose you can use with demo user and demo password and root user and root password okay but in this video i want to install it permanently okay so close this one then click on this installer see here escape to checking the installation media then select test see mx linux is an independent linux distribution based on on debian stable that's why at the time of virtual machine creation we have selected linux and subtype as debian okay so click on next and see here keyboard settings model pc105 layout us if you want to change the keyboard settings you have to click on change keyboard settings then click on next then then type of installation regular install using entire disk or customer is the disk layout okay it is up to you i'm so this is the fresh installation i'm going to use regular install using entire disk and click on next and if you want to encrypt you have to select the check boxes i don't want then click on next Installation confirmation. This just select this, then click on start. See, installation has been started. Now we have to provide the name for the computer. So, mix mix 
now select localization defaults i am going with american english time zone also american new york or you can so want to select select from this list okay then click on and select the time formats like 24 hours or 12 hours format okay click on next now we have to create our setup user so i am giving username as r2 schools then provide the password and from the same and if you want to enable root account select the check box and provide the password then confirm the same auto login i don't want save live desktop changes i don't want so click on next see installation is in progress so wait until this process to be completed to 100% then only we will be able to click on next okay so this will take time i am pausing this video in meantime please subscribe my channel for more tutorials see here installation complete see here the check box automatically reboot the system when the installer is closed so if you close this one it automatically restarts okay or you can restart manually so i want to restart so keep the check box and click on finish see now it is rebooting and see the message here please remove the disk close the tray and press enter to continue okay so go to virtual box and see here empty, optical drive is empty if it is not empty click on it and select the remove the disk from the virtual drive then come to virtual machine and hit enter see now it is rebooting see mx 23.6 liberty now provide the password of this user that we have created and hit end see close this one close this one and see here before we were having install application on desktop now it is gone okay and see here system resource information now open the terminal see here we have the xfce terminal or open type for here and open the terminal emulator let me increase the font go to edit then preferences then go to appearance then use the system font then click on this liberation mono regular then increase it by clicking on this plus button see now font has been increased now the first step after connecting to mx linux is we have to update the packages sudo apt update Um percent, um percent. Sudo apt upgrade. Hit enter. Provide the password of the sudo user. Hit enter. Type five for confirmation and hit enter. See, this will take time. Okay. So in this video, we have seen how to download and install MX Linux 23.6 on virtual box. For more tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.